Pena is a huge underdog in this fight. I don't take into consideration underdogs and favorites. I never felt like an underdog because I had all the skills. I always knew that I could win. I just needed an opportunity to show the world. My career in MMA started at 19 years old. Some people get a lot of background in karate or taekwondo or whatever it is. I threw my very first punch at 19 years old. My MMA career has been baptism by fire. It was hard for me to get the opportunities that I needed because there wasn't a place for women in the sport at the time. So when I started, I was fighting in barns. I was fighting in bowling alleys. I knew that I had the skills, but I didn't know how to get to the next step. So I was lucky and blessed enough to find a coach that actually cared about me. When you just have someone look you in the eyes and are eager to learn, eager to explore, you know, eager to be somebody, you just want to help. You just want to grab their hand and say, let's go, let's do this. Rick Little has been a staple in my life. He's been a mentor to me and the most important thing that I think that a fighter can have is a coach that truly cares about them. My coach always told me that Dana White was going to open up the doors to women in the UFC one day and lo and behold Dana put out a press conference that said that they were going to host the first season of The Ultimate Fighter for women. I got the plane ticket because I knew the moment that she was at tryouts and she locked horns and eyes with Dana White, he'd see the same thing. She treated the tryouts like a fight camp. And so she came on the show more in shape than any female, and when she entered the show, she was ready for war. I just needed one opportunity, and when the Ultimate Fighter presented itself, I knew that that was my shot. If Juliana has a chance, it's going to have to be getting this and turning into a real grueling exchange on the ground. I think the thing that Rick saw in me was intensity, that there was a level of intensity that I was bringing that he hadn't seen before. She's intense. She has a perfect mix of stubbornness. But the one thing she has is humbleness. She doesn't truly believe she's as good as she is. I don't know why that's in her head, but that's the reason for her success. My work ethic is second to none. I am a nose to the grindstone type of person and I believe that that stems from the way that I was brought up in my childhood, watching my parents bust their hump every single day. Uh, no one's gonna hand you anything in this life and you really have to go out there and, and work for it if you want something. She just like wants to get to work, you know. My formula is to match her intensity, match her excitement. There has been no harder road than the road that I've had to go down. I've had both of my arms dislocated. I've torn out both of my knees. The adversity that I have had to overcome in my career and in my personal life has built it up into this moment of you're fighting for a world championship. Oh, she got caught with the left. This is what Juliana wants, guys. Oh, this is the type of fight. Oh, she oh, oh big combination for Pena. This is crazy. Oh, let's go. She said she was going to go out there and take the fight to Amanda Nunes. Oh, oh, down by Pena. Look at this. She's got time. Oh, that is it. Juliana Pena what? What shot the world. <laughs> It takes a village to create a UFC fighter and it takes a village to make sure that this one individual has everything that they need around them so that they can go in confidently and get that hand raised. I needed somebody in my corner to believe in me and I needed someone that was going to walk with me through that fire and I have that. We did it! We did it! We did it! Yes! Which is a lot like what ZipRecruiter does for job seekers. ZipRecruiter champions job seekers, puts them in a position to win, and connects them with their next great opportunity. The Ultimate Fighter was the biggest launching pad of my career. Stay right there, shoulder pressure, pass out. To be coaching this season of The Ultimate Fighter is the craziest thing in my career because this is how I got my start in the UFC. I feel like everything's starting to come full circle. Winning a championship is one thing. Holding on to your championship and defending your belt is a complete other thing. That's gonna be the next phase of my career is holding on to my belt and making sure that I do everything in my power to retain my title. If you're looking for your chance to show what you got, ZipRecruiter is the place where you can go to take your own career to the next level.